Hello, my name is Dustin Bimberlake. I'm 29 years old and I happen to love street art and graffiti. This right here is my favorite graffiti wall. Um, as you can see, it's it's got a lot of substance to it. It's um it's really really cool. Whoever did this is an awesome graffiti artist. But I've enjoyed looking at. It. I come here every day, and um, you know I get a lot out of it. But it just goes on and on. It's probably a good 50 meters of just nonstop graffiti. This is one of my favorite spots to go to. It's freaking awesome, dude. Okay, now, Justin, let me get this straight. Um, you didn't do this street art. You actually just enjoy the street art and you want to show us the street art. Oh, that no, you me? Do? No, I'm not doing this. This is somebody else's work. I don't know how to do graffiti. I wish I did. Um, but no, this is not me. Uh, none of the graffiti that you're seeing is my graffiti. It's, it's all other people's graffiti. I just have a passion and a love for that graffiti. Okay, I hate to hurt your feelings, Justin, but that's actually really late. Why the freak are we even Well, I, I think it's pretty cool. What, you don't enjoy this? I think it's pretty, I, I like it. Um, I've had a great time with you guys. Y'all been real nice to me. Uh, I've had, I like, I think it's cool and I think I can make a lot of people interested. Okay, sorry, but it, it loses all of its cool points as soon as people find out you didn't do the graffiti. Well, can you please air it? Uh, I, I don't know, we signed the contract. I would, I would appreciate if you aired it because I think it would be really cool. I mean, I know you don't have much hope in it, but I think it would be really cool. It sucks, dude. So you will air it? Well, I don't see much of a story here. You're a random guy who enjoys graffiti. You're showing us around the different graffiti spots that you didn't do. Literally anybody could do that, Dustin. Anybody. All right, so now I'm going to take you all to another hot spot that I like with some even more incredible graffiti. Oh, cool, we get to see more graffiti that you didn't do. Dude, it's, it's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, I know I didn't do it, but I think you'll like it, just come on. Okay guys, so this is probably my second favorite spot of the graffiti tour, and um, this is right over here on 5th and 3rd Street. You can come by and see it whenever you want. But um, it's really cool, as you can see, it's got a, um, a an emotional guy, which is cool, it, it speaks volumes. And it looks like it's been painted over a few times. So um, you got like an old background and then they put new ones over it, which gives it a, a lot of depth to it, which I'm really excited about. Um, but yeah, I knew you guys, I'm sure y'all like it. You think it's good? Yeah, I knew y'all would like it. Um, again, I didn't do it. I actually did not paint this, but I noticed it. Um, I think I discovered it and it's great. And I knew you guys would like it. So thanks for coming along. Look, look, man, I'm actually very pissed off right now. Um, you screwed us on this whole thing and you lied to us about all of it. Look, man, don't get mad at me. I put in the description that I will show y'all graffiti in the city of Ta uh, Bangkok. I specifically put that before y'all signed the contract. And now you're gonna freaking pity party me the rest of the, the, the day while we're taping? Yeah, real nice, okay? If we could just do this in a fun and enjoyable way, I think we could both have fun here, okay? Yeah, I didn't do the graffiti. I never said I did the graffiti. Yeah, so you didn't do the graffiti, so why are we interested in this graffiti? Because it's cool. The graffiti is cool. I think we can all agree on that. The people on the internet, the people on YouTube, they're gonna enjoy the graffiti. People don't wanna see this, they wanna see Banksy. Fuck Banksy. Nobody cares about Banksy. This is what we're about. This is authentic street art. This is not mainstream bull crap, okay? Don't come at me with that talk. Now, can we please continue? I've got one more place to show you, maybe two or three, I don't remember. But will you please come with me? We don't want to, but I guess we will. Okay, thank you, and let's go. 
apologies. Um, Dustin Bimberlake actually thought it was going to be a good idea to carry the camera himself. Um, he thought it would look cool, it would be a cool little city shot, and um, he wouldn't let us say no to that idea. So here you are, he's carrying it. Now, he said this might be the last place. We might have two or three more, which, good gosh, I hope we don't. Um, but even if he has two or three more, I think we're going to try to cut him short on this one. He doesn't know it yet. He doesn't know it, but I think that's the plan right now. Um, this one, sorry it's sunny out here, it's freaking hot. This one admittedly is probably not my favorite, but it's got a lot of substance. As you can see, it goes on for, I don't even know, miles and miles. It's insane, dude, it's crazy. But, uh, oh, oh. But anyway, um, yeah, I love it. This is just quality work. Um, again, not my work. And let me make that clear before we go on any further. Not my work, just work I enjoy, you know? Um, so yeah, I hope you guys like this. And I've only got one more spot after this, so, you know, it is what it is, but daggum, look at that work. That's some good stuff. That's not mine, but daggum, it's good. I wish I could do that. All right, so listen, Dustin, um, me, my manager, and the rest of my team have talked it over, and we've agreed that we're gonna cut this thing short, okay? That's some real bull crap, Joe. That's some real bull crap. You're, you're gonna sign me up to do a documentary for Vice, like all the other cool ones that always complete, and then you're gonna cut it short. And don't give me this, oh, it's long enough already bull crap, okay? I know we can fit more content. I have a lot of other street art that I would love to show you guys, I would love to show the fans, but you're gonna cut it short. That's your idea of making me happy. Let's cut it short. Oh, it's been a long day. Let's cut it short. I'm just, oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. Remind me to never, and I mean never, submit an application to do anything with Vice ever again, okay? You can, you can go ahead and guarantee that. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm done with you too, okay? All right, Dust, I'm sure everybody here is gonna miss you. Look, I've seen your documentaries, they suck, okay? They suck. This would have been your top five, definitely. But whatever, throw away all the fame and fortune because you're not happy with the street art that I like. Okay, cool. So after finishing the documentary with um, Dustin Bimberlake, we sat down with him for a little one-on-one -on -one and realized that this guy is actually a complete idiot. Why would we ever choose him? So Dustin, I couldn't help but to notice you had a very interesting name, uh, Dustin Bimberlake. It's very similar to Justin Timberlake. Do you know Justin Timberlake? Are you aware of that? Do I know Dustin Bimberlake? Dude, I am Dustin Bimberlake. No, Dustin, I just said, do you know who Justin Timberlake is? Do you know who Justin Timberlake is? Who is, who is uh, Justin Timberlake? Who, what, what is, do I know the Justin Timberlake? Oh brother, no. Do you know Justin Timberlake? Not do you know the Justin Timberlake? Justin Timberlake's not my brother. Mother effer, Dustin. Justin Timberlake is a very famous guy. You don't know who he is? Do, do I know Justin Timberlake's mother? Oh my gosh, I'm done. Okay, I'm done. You don't know who Justin Timberlake is. I don't know Justin 